Yes, 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 I can. I am the greatest. I float like a butterfly, but I sting like a bee. Hey, YouTubers, this is KillerGay6, a.k.a. Raymond. Now, if you guys have seen by the title, today is the funeral service of one of the greatest boxers of all time, Muhammad Ali. Well, on Facebook, they actually have a live coverage of of the car driving to Louisville, Kentucky. That's where they're going for the funeral service. That's where he was born at. And holding the casket of Muhammad Ali. Now, they just arrived. They have the pallbearers, even the great boxers, Lennox Lewis and Mike Tyson, and also the man who played Muhammad Ali, Will Smith. Now, I'm sure you guys, I'm sure you guys, most of you guys don't know who Muhammad Ali is, but I know some of you guys do. He was one of the greatest boxers of all time. For a man who tells himself that I'm the greatest, I'm the best, nobody can beat me, and everything. You can, I can tell you guys that this is a man who actually says to himself that I'm the greatest, I'm going to show the world that I'm the best, and he is. Now you guys, bear in mind, he has done the best fights ever. I've seen old videos, next to my grandpa of course, my grandpa had videos of of him fighting. The one thing about this, because in the 80s they play back the old videos, my grandpa always tapes it all the time. I've seen it all. He had the best fights ever, even that phantom punch that, they, that he's done, that knocked the guy out. In the first round, that was something. And also the one that, what, oh man, the one that he, when he beat George Foreman, that was good. <laughs> for for that guy, he proved to be the the greatest, and he is the greatest. Now I've seen a lot of a lot of him on television a lot. He was once, like I said, he was on candid camera. He he surprised kids. There was kids that uh, was talking to the teacher that what would you do if you saw Muhammad Ali? What do you think about him? He said that he was the best best fighter ever. My mom, that's my dad's favorite. And when these guys were talking, Muhammad Ali was standing behind behind by the chalkboard. Back then, guys, they had chalkboards instead of uh, a white panel where you use the black markers and red markers, all that stuff. You see the guy just coming in, he was coming in and dressed in his boxing shorts, and then here he comes like phew, 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 and the kid's like his my name is Muhammad Ali, I'm the greatest boxer in the world. And then that one kid's like, Oh shit, oh shit where'd where you come from? And he said, What do you mean where I come from? Is my, did you just walk in here? And my says, No, I was just walking down the street and some kids said they wanted to meet me, so I came. <laughs> What's cool about it is that it made those kids' day, seeing one of the greatest boxers of all time standing right in front of them. You, you guys, it would, it's something for them. Also, uh, years late, uh, years before that, Sylvester Stallone was up on the Oscars when he wrote Rocky. Now, bear in mind, there is one thing that you guys don't know about that Rocky film. Sylvester Stallone wrote the script for Rocky. He watched a Muhammad Ali fight in the early 70s and he was so like uh, starstruck by Muhammad Ali he decided to write a movie about it and guess what guys he did he stayed in his house for three days for 23 hours writing that script three days and guess what guys that movie became the number one film of that year and it also won for best picture and Sylvester Stallone was on stage say, saying it was a privilege of me being standing right in front of you guys. Little did he know that behind him was walking Muhammad Ali. Like, really? And when Sylvester Stallone turned around and saw him, he was like, oh my god, really, you're here. And Muhammad Ali just said, I'm the real Apollo Creed. That was me. You stole my script. I did all the fighting. I'm the real Apollo Creed. <laughs> This is the man who that inspired Sylvester Stallone to make that script and made Sylvester Stallone a star. 
earlier in 2016, uh, three months after three months after he passed away, he had a uh, a birthday celebration. Sylvester Stallone was also there, said happy birthday to him. You know, guys, Muhammad Ali is the best. And also, little little unbeknownst to everyone that I did not know, I used to watch the Arsenio Hall show back in the early 90s. And they had uh, Sugar Ray Leonard, Mike Tyson, and Muhammad Ali. And <laughs> what the funny question is, well, Muhammad Ali, do you, like Mike Ty Muhammad Ali, says, do you think you can, if you, and you're young and you're in your prime again, do you think you can take Mike Tyson? And Muhammad Ali was like, I think I could. I think I can. He says, I know I can. I can beat him. And when he went to Mike Tyson, he said, what do you think, Mike? Do you think that you can beat him? And then he looked at him and said, look, I'm not going to lie. Look, I'm the greatest. I'm the greatest now, but you know what? He is still the best out of all of us. And no doubt about that. And like Muhammad Ali is like, that's right. That's right. <laughs> that shows respect, guys. He Tyson knows that he's it was the greatest in the '90s, but still to this day, Muhammad Ali is still one of the greatest fighters of all time. You don't want to mess with this guy. <laughs> but oh, it's just sad the fact that he has passed away. Still on Twitter, everybody is still saying we miss you and. The greatest of all time, float like a butterfly, sting like a bee. When they drove down the streets, everyone was saying, Ali, Ali, Ali. I'm sure you guys can see that on Facebook right now. It's just, wow. Hard to believe that the greatest boxer in the world is gone. But hey, he's still the greatest in our hearts and to everyone around the world. Give me your opinion on that, guys. I mean, Muhammad Ali is still one of the greatest boxers ever, and nobody can be that great ever. But hey, guys, that's the today's the service. I wish I could do a reaction video to that, but I can't. As you guys know, it's copyright stuff. But, well, I can't do a reaction video face to face, but, you know, taping the show and just having me on there. I think it's just best if we just hear the words of it, and it's always good. But give me, hey guys, give me your opinions on how you feel about that. Well, guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more reactions, more gameplay. <sighs> Muhammad Ali, you're still the greatest of all, boxers of all time, and there's no denying that. Thank you for watching, and don't forget, stay positive.